Okay, is there another spawner here somewhere? Because they just seem to keep coming. Oh no. It's almost dawn. And there's a blaze spawner there. Ow! Son of a... Okay, yep. Gas spawner is getting destroyed. Okay... I know I saw a blaze spawner somewhere. There it is! Oh god, so much lava. This is so dangerous. Okay, there we go. There's that. What's this? I don't know. Looks like a cave spider spawner. So, we got that out. That's good. Oh wow, that's a lot of mobs. Um, but yeah, as I was saying, I guess we have the three, like, types of, um, damage-dealing things. Like, we've got the, the zombies, which are kind of, like, melee, tanky enemies. Um, in that they, they do have a lot of health, and they have, they're the only mobs with armor, and they, um... I don't know how much armor. I would assume, like, about as much as pants would give. Just because that seems like a, a decent amount to give... You know, because a chest plate is pretty strong. Um, but boots and a helmet, uh, unless they're together, um, are pretty weak. Um, so I would just say pants because it's in the middle. And because they're zombies, not like, you know, something really powerful. I don't, I don't know. That looks like a blaze spawner up there. Oh, okay. Get away from me. What is that a spawner for? What the? How did he even see me? <sighs> okay, guys. I'm sorry if the commentary is a little lacking today. Um, I'm having trouble taking care of all these mobs. That was way off. Also, he's flying up, which is making it really hard to hit him. There we go. Okay, there's got to be an Enderman spawner somewhere. Okay, no. If I had two ender pearls, I'd feel a lot more comfortable throwing one in, running forward, grabbing the wool if there is some nearby, and then using another one to get back out. But I only have one right now. And that doesn't feel like enough. Okay, thank you for that creeper. Spawner is that? Spider? Looks like a spider spawner. Grab some diamonds. Grab some more diamonds. Wow. This is a lot of diamonds. We'll just grab that, thank you. Oh, oh. Oh, no, it's good. Skeleton spawner. Alrighty. Um, I also don't like that. Oh, that's going. So I might as well run up there and try to stop it. Really? Of course not. Go down! Jeez! Well, it's a cave spider spawner, no less. For some reason, my mouse didn't, like, my uh, cursor didn't want to go down. Which is pretty unfortunate, um, considering, you know, I almost got hit by a cave spider, which would have been really unfortunate, because, like, under normal circumstances, getting hit once by a mob, not that big of a deal, especially when I'm sitting here with half diamond armor. Um, alright, alright, I see how you're, I see how you're playing. Ow, yep, that was stupid of me. Uh, 
if I stay back, I should be fine. Okay. Because the, the fire does exactly enough damage to kill you, so if you have any regeneration, you should be fine, as long as you're at max health before. If you weren't at max health, then you better hope you're going to be okay. Um, or at least, I, it used to do exactly enough damage to kill you, but I don't know what it does now, so... Because um, I know they nerfed fire a while back, and I'm not really sure how much or whatever, and... Okay, there's got to be some, like, giant space here that I'm missing, because things are spawning all over the place behind me. Okay, that's not helpful. Thank you, Creeper. Okay, the skeletons have way too good aim. That's the problem. They, like, the amount of damage they do would be fine if they couldn't hit you every time. But they can hit you every time, and that just makes it totally unfair. Or at least they can hit you, like, 90% of the time. Like, of course, as I say, they can hit you every time one misses me. Oh, jeez, I fell in a hole and that scared the crap out of me! Really, they're just going to walk around the lava? What the heck? What the heck is that? There's a freaking hole in the ground, so that they didn't even think about going towards the uh, lava. Bam, right in the face. Okay, out of torches again. Let's make some more. I really need to remember to, uh, <laughs> use my scroll wheel, or not scroll wheel, my, um, number buttons to get from... What the heck? No, stupid Enderman. Give me that Ender Pearl. Also, the skeletons have way too much knockback. Like, if the arrow didn't knock you back... Oh, man. See, like, they just put all of the good things of being ranged on it, and it makes it way too overpowered. Like, the benefits of being ranged are sometimes knockback in video games. Um, uh, sometimes damage, because it is considered, a lot of times, one of the agility um, things. Like, if you play Oblivion... Um, the Elder Scrolls 4, Oblivion, uh, agility affects your ability to use bows, and agility is also usually affects, like, your critical hit chance. Oh, would you look at that? Um, so, generally, things that, sh or people that shoot have a good chance to crit, which means that they can, and a good attack speed, because agility also usually affects attack speed, um, or at the very least, they have both. Uh, something that gives them attack speed and something that gives them crit chance. Um, so they can do a lot of damage. Um, and then uh, you have, obviously, the obvious range advantage. Um, because, you know, melee enemies will have to run up to you before they can actually hit you, while you can just shoot them far away. Which, combined with the knockback, usually makes for some decent survivability. Um... But then added to the fact that they have high attack da or high damage, and um, uh, good accuracy as well is like it's just ridiculous because they make it really hard to get near them, and when you can get near them, they still do tons of damage to you. Um, and then in groups of like three, like even me decked out in all this armor, I'd take on an army of creepers, but like five skeletons freaks me out. It's just way too many. Because they can just constantly shoot me and keep me from getting close to them. And it makes everything so much more difficult. Knocked him off. Oh, jeez. <laughs> that was fortunate. They could have started spawning way before I noticed they were there, but... Freaking flaming spiders. Okay, things are getting a little bit better here because we're coming into an area where there's a lot of lava. So, like, to begin with, there's a lot of light here. Um, we are getting a little bit lower, which is making it harder to see. So let's try coming back up here. Grab this diamond while we're here. Um, 
And let's see, how much diamond do I have? 33. That is more than enough to start making armor. Like, that's more than enough for a full suit of armor. So where did I throw my food to? Um, so let's make us some pants and some boots. And then get those on. Okay. And throw... Okay, I'm going to have to throw these into lava. Oh. I don't have... I'll stand like this. So that, uh... I can't accidentally get knocked into the lava. Okay. Now things just don't want to go into the lava. Um... We have a lot of gunpowder. We could make some TNT. Let's do that. Because TNT is always good to have. Um, you never know when you're going to need it. And all that good stuff. Wow, we had like just enough sand. Okay, now that we've got that... Oh, that's not what I want to do. Let's throw the rest of the gunpowder in there. The string. Um... No, the string. It actually hit the stuff, but it just bounced back out. You can throw that away. Um, grab some of that. Throw those away. Throw those away. Can we have some TNT? Can we make a flint and steel? Oh, I threw some flint away earlier, didn't I? That's unfortunate. We don't need the sand anymore. Okay. Now, let's see. There's a spider there. He won't be much of a problem. Actually, how many arrows do we have? Ooh, we're not doing too well on arrows here. Um... Let's climb up here, light it up a bit, Let's see if we can get ourselves up a little bit. Okay, there is a gas spawner in the ceiling, um, which, mm, could we circumvent that? Um, oh, really? shouldn't have happened. Um, I think we can go around that gas spawner. I'm not entirely sure, but it looks like it. So, uh, if we can, we're going to be trying to do that, because I don't want to have to deal with the gas shooting at me all the time, and while I'm trying to kill other things, and just, it just wouldn't be good. Hop on up there, buddy. You too there, buddy. Really? You're going to be smart enough to go around it? Alright. Blew up in a big spot there. Mm. I'm keeping an eye out for spawners. Uh, because, obviously, there's lots of them in here. Like that one right there. If I can clear out these skeletons first, I may be able to just charge that spawner. Uh, I want to get this, these creepers, too. This is, That zombie just disappeared. <laughs> I love it when I can see mobs despawn. It's just like, oh, would you look at that? He disappeared. What? How did that not kill him? I know bow damage is based on... Alright. He just disappeared on me while I was trying to shoot at him. Like, while the arrow was in transit. Okay, spawner's gone. Whoa, buddy, no. What is that doing? Okay, I'm a safe distance away. I can shoot at them, they can still shoot at me, but I should have time to dodge it. Um, unfortunately, it's hard to see that far away. They are despawning, that's good. Um, I think that's a creeper spawner up there. Oh no, I'm out of arrows. Oh, that's bad. That's really bad. Um, let's see if I can't come back here and have that guy despawn. We can still see both of them. Because there's not much I can do to fight them right now with no arrows. Man, I can't believe I ran out of arrows. They've been giving us so many. Okay, one guy's gone. And there's the other one. Fantastic. Um, is there anything else that I can make out of diamonds? Uh... Let's throw these away. Grab this. I really want a flint and steel. So let's try to get some 
some flint from this gravel here. Oh, I got one. Okay. Actually, that's this way. There we go. Um, oh, yeah, right. I haven't shown you guys the flint and steel texture. That's the flint and steel texture. Um, <laughs> If you were wondering. I made it myself. I just want this so that I can blow stuff up uh, on a moment's notice if I need to. Because, I mean, come on. It's a Vex map. We're probably going to need to. Like, mm. whoa, whoa, when did that get there? Okay, guys, stop it. I did not see this. Like, situations like this? Oh, right. You have to right click it now. I don't usually use TNT, so. If I seem a little stupid about it, that's why. That's a lot of, um... Why is there lava in there? That's not cool. Also not cool, that blaze right over there. Die. I don't like the lava in here. But we've got the black wool. And let's sprint through here real quick. Um, see if there's anything of note. Doesn't look like it. Except for a few giant slimes. Um, let's run back through here. Oh, lots of lava. Okay. I see your I see your point. Lots of lava. Gotcha. Good. Good good talk. But no thank you. Oh jeez. Alrighty. Um oh, good, there's the workbench. We can that was a little bit delayed. We can make... Oh, I want that. It's just going to pick it up again anyway. Okay. Um, I don't want that. I really don't need bones. I don't need string. I don't really need gunpowder anymore. Since I have some... stuff. Let's make another diamond sword for when this one breaks. Um, let's see... Let's go around and find some of that obsi all of this little obsidian around. Try to mine some out. Um, we only need four for an enchanting table. I do need some reeds, though, and leather. Crap. Wait, just reeds. Sorry, I, f I forget. I'm getting confused between the, um, the newest update and this one. Um, I think I'm, I'm on, on 1.2.5 right now. I'm pretty sure I swapped, over, swapped back over to that. Um, when I... before I started playing. Um, I, I put... I, I really try to make an attempt to stay on the right one, because if I'm not, then that means there's a lot of differences that just, like... you know, it's... I think it's not good, especially for a Let's Player to, uh... well, specifically for a Let's Player to be playing on the wrong version of Minecraft. Um... And it's really dangerous swapping between things like that, because I know Captain Sparkles went and, um, he, whoa, I wasn't expecting that, um, he accidentally opened his Let's Play World in the wrong version of Minecraft, and kind of destroyed his jungle biome, um, because it, he downgraded to a version of Minecraft that didn't have jungles in it, and then accidentally opened his, his world, and, right, I need the, um, I need a book. But yeah, he, uh, he accidentally downgraded and opened his world up, and the jungle biome became a desert biome. Um, because it didn't know what biome it was, so it just changed it to what it thought it should be, as if it had generated new land, and that's what happened. Um... So, unfortunately, his entire jungle turned grayish, brownish. I should say brownish, not grayish. Um, but yeah, so it's it's really kind of dangerous to mess around with things like that. Particularly, or, or not so much now, um, as it used to be. Because before, you could accidentally, um, like, corrupt your world. I don't know if, it still, if, it, if that still happens... I don't think it does. Um, 
I think they've taken steps to avoid that happening because it's kind of a big problem. Oh, Jesus. That scared me. Excuse me for saying that to any of you who may take offense. Um... I forgot what I was talking about. This was a rough dungeon. Um, I'm glad that we're out of it. I, this will probably be two. Ep this will definitely be at least two episodes, um, depending on how long it is. I mean, if it's, I'll make three videos if if I only because I doubt that I've been playing for an hour and a half. Um, so if I have been playing for like an hour and twenty minutes or an hour and fifteen minutes, like I what the heck? Since when? <laughs> I don't remember that being there. Um, I, I'd be willing to make three episodes if each of them is, like, I'm not willing to make an episode shorter than 25 minutes, because, you know, I usually make them... Oh, right, we went, this is the one in the mountain. That's why it's so deep. Gotcha. I was confused by the clouds there. I was like, um, why are there clouds? We're pretty far down. We were just down at bedrock, but realistically we were down at bedrock quite a while ago. And we've climbed quite a distance since then. Oh, wow, so much crap. Um, let's see, we'll get rid of that. Um, well, we don't have any arrows, so I guess the bow isn't of much use to us. Let's see that. We're keeping this diamond on us because that could be extremely valuable. That could be invaluable, I should say. Um, because having a lot of diamonds is definitely a good thing. Oh, look, leather. Um, <laughs> one sugar cane. Okay, this is a tough decision now. So we don't need that. We do need a... Wait, no, we don't need leather. Right. I forget. Sorry. I keep confusing myself. Um, we don't need leather. Well, of course, now there's arrows up here. You know, actually, I'm going to go back and get the bow. Because, I mean, I'm sure we'll come across one again soon. But, regardless... Whoa, I almost fell to my death there. Sorry for freaking you guys out, because I'm sure at least one of you freaked out. I should probably just talk to you guys like like you're one person. Um, I know Charlie McDonald just posted a video, like, last week or something about that specific thing, where he talks to his viewers as if they're one viewer instead of a group of viewers. I don't ever use those. Because, really, you're just one person. Like, I'm talking to you, the one the one person that you are that's watching this. I mean, yes, a lot of people watch this, but they don't watch it together. I'm not addressing a, a large group of people. I'm just addressing one person. How the heck did we get in here? Ah, uh, here we go. Um, so, to address you as a group of people is a little silly. Because you're not a group of people, you're one person. But regardless, there are, like, it's it's confusing for me to think about, just because, like, yes, there are many, or I don't want to say many people watching my videos, but there are some people watching my videos. Um, there is there is more than one person watching my videos. So when I talk to you, I feel like I should be addressing all of you. Yet, if I talk to you as more than one person, you, the one person just sitting there, watching my videos is is going to be like, well, I'm only one person, you know, unless you, you know, you watch my videos with friends, which, I mean, psh, go ahead, that'd be cool. Um, I'd, I'd be happy knowing that my viewers like to share me with their friends. Okay, that's a really big forest, and I don't see where to go from it. See, again, we came from that way. So, that looks interesting. Let's head down there. What are these lines? Oh, it's just the, the side of the stone. Okay. Ow. Oh, you know, we could probably find some reeds pretty easily, especially if we went back to that desert. Yeah, I wonder if this is just just just, blah, 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 just chance over there. That that little clearing is there. Um, it does look a little suspicious, but I can't decide if it's just, you know, me thinking everything looks suspicious, or if it's actually suspicious. Uh, let's just go check this out before... I, I'm. That probably sounded a little bit Canadian. I, I do that sometimes. I don't know why, and it's just weird. Um, 
Yeah, let's just come down here and check this out. And if it's nothing, if it's just a little clearing, by chance, no big deal. Um, which it does appear to be. Except it's got a zombie in it. Um, man, level 70. Jeez. Like, even on my Let's Play, I've never gone to level 70 before. Yeah, it looks like this clearing is just a chance clearing. So, I guess I'll end the episode here. Okay, thank you guys for watching and uh, bearing with me through this entire boring episode. I mean, that was a lot of combat and everything, and I don't, I don't usually edit my videos because I don't like to... I don't know. I feel like you guys are missing something if you don't see everything. Um, I mean, obviously when I mine and stuff, I take stuff out in Let's Plays or whatever, but in maps like this, you, I could die at any moment. I don't want to stop recording, and I don't want to have to edit stuff out, and it's partially me being lazy, partially me not wanting you guys to miss anything, so just keep that in mind. Okie dokie. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye!